The billing app makes it easy for you to create invoices and subscriptions for your clients and gives your clients a streamlined way to pay, track invoices, and manage payment methods. To use the billing app, go to your billing settings and connect your bank account. This lets us send money to you. Also on this page, you can set defaults for what payment methods you want to accept and also if you wish to absorb transaction fees or whether you want to pass them on to your clients. To see and create a new invoice, go to Billing, Invoices. Here you can see a full list of invoices and their associated information. You can click this button to export. And this icon tells you that an invoice was created as part of a subscription. Invoices can be in draft state, open state, paid state, or void state. To create a new invoice, click on New. Select an individual client or company. If you select a company, any client associated with the company can view and play the invoice. Add one or more line items, each with a price and quantity. Optionally, add taxes. Specify if you want to auto charge or notify the client to pay manually. If you select automatically charge payment method, you must add a payment method for the client if there isn't one on file yet. If you select notify client to pay manually, the client will receive an email notification that notifies them about the invoice. If you select this option, you also have to set a due date. Optionally, add a memo. Optionally, add attachments. And lastly, in the advanced settings section, you can specify if you want to allow credit card payments, ACH payments, or both. And you can specify if you or your client pays for the payment processing fees. In the top right, you can also click on preview to get a preview of the client experience. If you selected that the client has to pay manually, you can preview the checkout process, the invoice, and the client email notification. Once we click create, you can see the status will say draft. If you click on the Actions button, you can send the invoice, which updates the status to Open. You can also copy the payment link and share it directly with the client. You can see invoices on this page, or if you want to see invoices specific to a single client, you can also select a client on the Clients page and go to the Invoices tab. Now let's go to the subscriptions page. Here you can see all of your subscriptions, which will show with the active, canceled, or past due status. Let's create a new subscription. Compared to the invoice creation flow, here you'll see some additional fields, including the billing period, start date, and end date. Subscriptions are shown on the main subscriptions page, but you can also see client-specific ones on the client details sidebar. When a client receives new invoices, they will receive an email notification. They're brought to the checkout process when they click on the notification. If they back out of the invoice, they will still see an open invoice that needs to be paid. The number on the sidebar indicates how many invoices are still open. The client can click on Pay to start the checkout process. Here the client can select a payment method and complete the checkout flow. 